uh, last one, not great, but uh, 17, I mean, it was a fantastic round. Yeah, I played well today. I had fun. Uh, Kevin, Kevin and I had a good time today, and we both were uh, making some birdies, so it was a fun day. Phil, what did you pull out of this week uh, from start to finish? Well, the areas that I need to work on, and uh, I was able to uh, I hit the ball pretty well uh, tee to green throughout the week. I didn't uh, putt the best the first few days, but putt it pretty good today. Everybody's intrigued by your two iron. Can you tell us about that club? Because you were really hitting it. Uh, it's just a, a two iron that uh, Callaway's made for five or six years now. It's got a little bit of a backing to it. Kind of an X-Tour two iron that uh, is very easy to get up in flight. And so uh, it's going to be in the bag at uh, Congressional, and I anticipate using it quite a bit. Have you seen the new configuration at Congressional? The new layout? The finishing holes? No, I'll see it. I'll see it here uh, next few days. Plan on going up, playing a few practice rounds. I will, yes. Phil, Thanks, can you, Phil. Talk, can you talk about obviously going into Congressional when you went in, going into the Masters and won its shell? Now you're coming into Congressional, playing what we think is pretty good actually after the day. How do you feel going in, and and what when you say you you identified what you need to work on? What is that specifically? It's uh, it's really it's getting a good feel on the greens. I mean, it's got it's getting a good speed. Um, the first three days, my speed was off, so if I had a good read, I'd either hit it through the break or I'd come up short and miss it low because I didn't use enough pace. Uh, my speed from uh, six, outside of six feet, six to 35 feet, the putts you really got to make to, to get a good round going, uh, was off a little bit the first few days. And today, I felt like I had some pretty good pace. Even the ones I missed were rolling a foot and a half by, which is about the, the speed I'm looking for. Phil, a lot of low scores today from a lot of golfers today. What was different about the course today compared to the first A little bit of rain last night made it a play a lot easier. So just softening the greens, even softening the fairways made them a lot easier to hit. Phil, can you talk about what the Open means to you? Obviously, you had a number of close calls there. Yeah, I'd, I'd love to win our National Open. I've come close uh, five times now, five second place finishes. Uh, which is actually a good sign in the sense that it's a course or a setup that uh, probably nobody thought I would do well in throughout my career, and yet I've played uh, some of my better golf in the U.S. Open, and I just uh, need a few breaks here and there or maybe uh, a, a few less mistakes here or there to uh, be able to come out on top. Is it about it this time last year when you started having those issues? Um, you know, the, it was, yeah. It's been about a year, and so uh, I feel pretty fortunate to... Uh, feel as though I'm able to practice and play and, and, and do most of the things, uh, most everything I, I was able to do before. Your performance at the Open, pretty amazing considering what, what you were going through and what you didn't know you had to deal well, with Well, at there. the time I didn't think much of it, you know, I just thought it was one of those things that uh, you get a little ache here and it'll go away. So uh, I didn't think that it was anything out of the ordinary. Can you identify with Stricker with uh, just the way he's playing today in this whole tournament? I mean, what is that like, that feeling that he's going through? It seems like everything's going in. Yeah, he's a, he's a heck of a player, boy. When he gets it going, you get you give him greens and putting surfaces as, as smooth and as pure as ease, he's really tough to beat. Jonathan Bird was saying you know, yesterday that, that with Tiger's absence and his injuries and stuff going on, that it's given it's opened a window for a lot of American players to jump in. How do you think you've done in, in that time, uh, the, the two years that he's kind of struggled to get his game back and his injuries and whatnot? Uh, with, with the exception of a glimpse here or there, you know, the Masters at Houston Open, I really haven't played the level I, I expect to or have throughout, the, throughout my career. Um, but it's okay. There, there's there been some other things going on, and uh, I feel like my game right now is really good. I just, I'm, this whole year I felt like it's been close. I've been playing very well, tee to green. Uh, short game feels pretty good, but uh, chipping anyways. I, I just, uh, I haven't putted to the same level that I've, uh, I'm used to, but... Today was a much better day. Today was uh, how I expected to, to perform on the green. For Phil, Warner, Phil, like yourself, is that is it just a little bit disappointing knowing that that window is there? And it's like you're saying, you, you want sure, to sure, but it's a marathon. I mean, it's not a sprint. You know, we got a long, you know, long, long time here to uh, to get things going. You know, it can it can turn in a week. Phil, and, how do you? Um, I'm just trying to progressively get better. How do you, um, given all that was kind of going on and the questions with your health and not even really able to grip the club last year at Pebble, where, where do you rate? that performance for grit and stick to itiveness and those You know, again, of... Steve, I didn't think much of it at the time. I just thought it was one of those things where you get a little ache here, there, and it just goes away. So at the time, I didn't think much of it. But um, uh, And so it, it had not progressed as bad as it uh, got a few weeks later. So it wasn't it wasn't that big. Okay. Thank you. Some kind of adjustment in the irons. Uh, earlier this year, you had stretches where you really haven't been hitting all that close. And this week, you know, today especially, you 
knock it down and change the significant changes here? No, the only difference I'm trying to make is uh, I'm trying to get a little more touch, a little bit softer, softer transition, trying to get a little bit more feel in the swing on those on those iron shots where I'm taking five, seven, eight yard shots off of, off of a full swing. And uh, my iron performance has been much better this year. Uh, trying to create more feel. Now I'm trying to carry that over onto the greens. I tried today to get a much softer feel and touch and, and I putted a lot better doing that. Thank Thanks. you. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks.